I think a lot of people are influenced by their mothers and mine was very influential on many, many people of all ages, of children, of babies and children and adults and elderly. And she was a Māori teacher specifically because of family insecurity. Mum was a was a victim of domestic violence at home and that happened as long as I can remember. Throughout the whole, my whole childhood and things and that whole ordeal, I became really ashamed of who I was. I was really ashamed of my Māori tanga and I learnt that that's I've found it again, and I've managed to find my spirit. I, I, throughout that thing I grew up, everyone idolised my mother, um, and it was set in stone for everyone that I was to be just like her. But I never actually really wanted to be like her. I wanted to be the complete opposite. I didn't want to be a hypocrite. I wanted to be strong enough to walk away and I wanted to be strong enough to be a good influence. And though my mother was a strong influence, it wasn't necessarily good. So I wish to be, um, I wish to be a good influence. I think um, I wanted to be like my mother in respect to working with people and influencing them in a good way and so I'm doing that now and it's really good.